hey my friend so what's your one thing you got to figure out what your one thing is or your message if you want to sell anything online you can't be all over the place and you have to figure that out so we're going to talk about how to figure that out and we're going to give you a couple examples I'm going to talk about the things I'm doing the courses I've done and how you can figure out your one thing and what do we mean by the one thing all right so we'll get to that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so one of the things that I've been learning about recently is exactly that what is my one thing right I'm doing these course income secrets what does that mean to anybody who's listening what do they think that's all about right so for me defining the one thing that I'm talking about has to has has helped me to try to make uh content that's a little bit more focused a little bit more direct a little bit more appropriate to whoever is following me who's like some people are following me because you know they know me already so they're they're enjoying the content just because it's me just because I'm creating it but also if I'm trying to attract more audience members more people I'm trying to get more fans well the message has to be congruent with my uh my well the the content has to be congruent with the message so that's what we're talking about when we're talking about the one thing by the way if you're listening to the audio of this you really want to go check out the video and the blog post at cis288.jsgagnon.com go check out the video and the blog post there because in the video obviously I show screen shares and I, you can see my expression you can see me who I am and all that all right so now let's go and share the screen let's first start off by something pretty basic is you go to YouTube and you say what what is your one thing right now when we do that we find a whole bunch of things that have to do with personal development that have to do with like this one here which find your one thing day 28 of 30 of getting results that sounds amazing that sounds great but really in marketing it's not <laughs> something you do at the end like you know he's talking about 28 of 30 days of getting results on the on the almost the last day figuring out your one thing that might be true in some uh, parts of your life or different things you're trying to do but in marketing your one thing is almost pretty much has, has to be defined at the very beginning what do, what, do we, what do we mean by the one thing so let's say I go for example to my um my course hosting site right click eCourse so if I go there and I look at the courses I have on that site the courses that I've posted that I've created like for example the TikTok master's course or the LinkedIn growth secrets course or uh well that's not mine but yeah so and then fastest syndication process these are courses that I um uh, that I posted that I created right courses that I've done there's then there's a bunch of other courses that are <coughs> that are um uh, either PLRs or or things that um that are like this simple online strategies that's actually my uh my videos I've done every day that I just posted in, in a in a course but yeah so I mean if I look at a course like say for example I look at my LinkedIn connection growth secrets okay if I look at that this is a course that teaches how to grow your LinkedIn uh your LinkedIn connections in by a thousand a month right so I mean I've got this in here and I I definitely have to improve the message here because I actually tried to promote this this course I actually did ads to it and I didn't get any results any sales or anything and that's on and uh, but you know I didn't spend thousands of dollars just uh, just you know a few hundred dollars to test it out to see whether I would get any results and I think that that might be one of the reasons I didn't spend enough but the other reason is I didn't have enough um I actually didn't have enough the message wasn't clear enough so okay so your what is your one thing what is your message so whenever you're thinking about the thing you're selling let's let's say we take this course here LinkedIn connection growth secrets what is it that I'm offering people right it's it's a course to learn how to grow your 
linkedin connections right to grow fast a thousand a month right uh, that's because I was able to do that so I can kind of show you how to do it so the one thing is you know how to grow your LinkedIn connections by a thousand a month without getting put in LinkedIn jail <laughs> for example I don't know right that could be but the one thing is the message that you want people to that will attract people to finding out more right that will attract people to to want to learn more about it so if I think of this this is a course what 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 is and this is the thing for me I'm I, I'm actually right now as I'm recording this thinking to myself okay what is the one thing for this course right the one thing for the course right like for example I got this bonus here in here oh sorry which is one of the older videos I did in 2016 on how to grow your connections hasn't changed a lot there's been changes to LinkedIn since because this was before Microsoft bought them out but that gives you another idea anyways whatever that's not the point the point is your one thing your one thing has to be something that you're going to use in your marketing in your messages in your in your uh derive your you have to derive your content from that right so let's just uh, maybe think about another course if I think about another course um if I go back to my courses here you know if I think about the courses so TikTok master's course right TikTok master's course really should probably be named TikTok's TikTok ABC basics or something right uh, originally I called it TikTok master's because I thought we would get into more details and with Mayan there was some so there is some content that she created in here that was more about the um the the actual strategies to to you to post on TikTok right uh but this is what is the one thing here what is it that that people will be what will make them want to take a look at this course right um I should probably have a deal on this course right you want a deal let's give you a deal um it should be 97 dollars, even maybe 40 45 or 40 or 27 dollars. How, how much should it be to have somebody want to you know get this course this is a course that's got like the same number of lessons it's got uh, <coughs> we have uh, what is it we have 52 lessons two hours and 35 minutes of, <coughs> of of videos teaching you all sorts of different things uh about TikTok you know how to how to go and get an analytics the difference between for you and following the recording uh, how to record different ways to record the stickers monetizing description uh, promoting a company getting sales post frequency music promotions disappearing text and then timer and speed and effects and duet and music and voice and filters and react and like and follow and commenting and responding and trending and and you know all these different things about TikTok. if you want to learn how to use TikTok, this is what this is about so what would be the one thing what would be the one message right um it's a basic it's this is okay so how do you come up with your one thing right think about what your what your audience is going to get out of this course so your offer and the one thing are basically to connect it right so your offer like I, I don't know if you've seen this before but like I said before your offer is not what you're selling your offer is what they're going to get out of it so if you're selling a course like this TikTok master's course or TikTok beginner course or TikTok basics course or TikTok ABC course whatever you want to call it um the title of the course the one thing everything is tied together right so the the so let's just say okay what is it that I want people to get out of this right well they're going to learn how to use the the TikTok platform in a way that they can start to learn about uh virality about about uh posting videos regularly about about how to post videos they're, they're going to learn the basics of how to use TikTok so they be, they can become masters at TikTok so you know maybe the and and the one thing is typically how to here let's just uh, open up a little uh, notepad here new text document text document let's call this notes so okay let's just open this up and say okay what is the one thing 
<laughs> okay so the one thing first of all the one thing is your message it's also what whoops what you want uh, people thinking about it's your what what they will get out of your offer right so there the one thing is and and it's uh, it's also basically something like how to blank without blank right so that's typically that's your one thing your one thing is how to do something without something they don't want right so I mean in the case of the TikTok course so for example my TikTok course for my TikTok course it could be how to uh, use TikTok <coughs> like a pro without mm, without making mm, well no without what without um without wasting time on um on platform I don't know maybe, maybe that could be it right but the thing is that whenever you decide what your one thing is it becomes the way you talk about the thing ab about the course right about the offer about your about the thing you're selling or the thing you're offering them as a result right so I mean it could be how to um learn how to uh learn TikTok fast without whoops without without what how to learn TikTok fast and then and I'm kind of thinking this out right now kind of out loud kind of give you some ideas maybe for you to come up with you know what is your one thing right what is your one thing that you you know that you that for your offer like I said right anyways I'm just kind of rambling off here but I'm just trying to think so how to learn TikTok fast uh without um really it's it's what's what is it about TikTok right what is it that uh fast okay maybe it it can it can be so you uh can be seen by your fans faster so I don't know right and it's and I guess it's not always how to without it can be the idea is that you want to tell you want to be the one thing has to be something that they're going to learn or they're going to um uh, they're going to they're going to accomplish or they're going to um uh buy or well not buy but what's the word I'm thinking about you know they have to it has to be something that they're going to benefit from no not benefit they're going to achieve they're going to receive they're going to accomplish something they're going to accomplish right something they're going to get out of out of your offer what is it they're going to get and <laughs> and then it's going to be without something they don't want right what is it that somebody doesn't want when they're learning a new platform right so that's something that I kind of have to think about because if I want to have a course that teaches about TikTok then what is it that people don't want right well, I'm just trying to see so I mean maybe it's about it's about become a tick becoming a TikTok uh yeah because you know some of the things if you look on TikTok there's a lot of videos that are just like dancing videos and stuff right so nothing really super uh business kind of like or anything like that right so maybe that's what I need to be talking about because my my TikTok course kind of talks about also how um you can use TikTok for business right so maybe it's how to learn how to use TikTok for business without doing silly dancing videos right that could be that right so that could be that right let me just uh, see here 
so I mean yeah so okay so TikTok, how to so what else so without doing silly dancing videos that could be my one thing right how to do how to use TikTok for business so maybe it's the basics so um yeah how to use TikTok? that probably is a really good the one thing for my for my TikTok course right so what about my okay so what about for my LinkedIn course LinkedIn connection growth course so what would that be so how to grow your LinkedIn LinkedIn connections by 1000 a month without getting put in LinkedIn jail so I mean that 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 actually I think that could actually be a good a good uh, one thing for my LinkedIn course right and if I think about the platform itself if I'm if I think about the platform itself or the the course income the click ecourse platform right so what about the platform so what do I what do I say there right the platform you know for for the click ecourse platform now this is one thing that I I don't actually I uh, want I don't really want to be building my <coughs> to be building my um or to be promoting the platform itself because that's and maybe and I and I will I'll have to do that at some point <coughs> but for now I'm not right because I don't want I don't believe I think it would cost too much to try to promote the platform what I got to do is I got to promote things in the platform and and that gets people inside the door just by being part of the platform like for example if you if you were to if you were to buy my LinkedIn connection growth secret course you would be in my platform because you would use the platform to 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 go through the course right so I don't need to promote the platform itself so that's something that you might be able to do if you're building some sort of software solution or if you have a course that teaches people how to create their own I don't know uh, PHP website right for example right which I probably could do a course like that because that's kind of what I do right I build websites <coughs> using PHP using my SQL using Linux so I could probably teach Ooh, sorry I could probably teach those things too right okay so for the clips but still if I wanted to have a one thing for my course platform right so <coughs> so how to host your own course um well I guess it I don't know if it's how to host your own course right let's just uh actually I'm gonna make this like this because just make it obvious that these are separate sections my TikTok course <coughs> okay so how to host your own course um without spending tons to promote it or uh, maybe it should be where where can you host your own course and uh, without without uh spending tons to get it to, to make it make it available uh, I don't know that's so obviously that's uh, and, and the other thing and that's the thing right that might not be the right message because that particular I mean my platform is is a platform for whole course hosting and it's just like it's just like if you were trying to Microsoft you know remember Microsoft when they were advertising word Microsoft word which is um basically it's a it's 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 a word processing software right where you can do uh, paragraphs in there and text and you can make things bold and underline and all these things which every single <clears throat> piece of software does now right but when they first came out with word at that time that's like well, I don't know 15 years ago or even what 19 it, it would have been in 1990 oh, that's like 20 years ago 20 25 years ago anyways so when they first came out with it at the time the big the big word processing 
uh thing that everybody had was called word perfect right and word perfect uh in those days was on a computer with no no graphical display it was just text right so if if you had if you had um special character types they would be like with a, a red background or a green background or a blue background that kind of stuff but it was always just text that just was normal so when they came out with word word was graphical right it was based on yc wig is what you call but also just around that same time word perfect came out with their graphical version of word perfect and word both of them were doing the same thing but word perfect was advertising that their word processing editor could let you do cut and paste paragraphs move them around and things like that things that both of them were doing they, they both could do that but word word was advertising that they could do that as if they were the only one but that so that so the point of this uh this story is that <clears throat> you got to remember that even if you think that your solution your offer it does the same thing as everybody else's offer it doesn't mean you can't use that message because the message <laughs> can still resonate with whoever is seeing it whoever is reading the message whoever's looking at your message whoever's seeing your message your content and everything <laughs> they resonate not just with the message they also resonate with you as well right so that's part of it so like me when I talk about my course hosting platform you know how whoops like I'm so that happens so much when I why oh why you oh instead of why oh you so where you can <laughs> where where can you host uh your own course without spending a spending tons to make it available so maybe um uh, how to host your own course own course um um with coupons and deals um just just like the pros I, I don't know that's probably not that's pro no that's not what I want to say so how to host your own course with coupons and deals I don't know right I mean like I said that's that's pretty standard but at the same time somebody might see this and then they might not know that the other platforms have that and they're like oh this this one does that so they might they might get connected with you versus the others because you actually mentioned that in your message right but like I said your one thing your one thing is what you're going to be using for all of your marketing around your press so let's not let's not worry about the the rest let's just talk about say for example my TikTok my TikTok course I want to make that my one thing so what does that mean so if I do that as my one thing right how can I make so what does that mean to everything else your one thing is becomes your big domino it becomes your so okay so now let me just think here uh the next the next part of this process is once you have your one thing then you need to have a story around that one thing right so I mean you know I remember when I, I first started TikTok it was like December December 2019 so last year actually a year from now and I remember I've been seeing Gary V talking about you should be using TikTok TikTok is the is the is has is is the the next social media platform that you should be looking at and you should go on TikTok and you should be on there and and he he was hammering everybody about it for like a year before I actually went on there right and I'm thinking you know what let me just go take a look at it so I went and I looked at it and when I first opened it <laughs> when I first opened it up all I saw was these you know dancing these girls dancing the that's all that's all it is that's on there that you see when you first open up the app because the app doesn't even know what you like so they're going to show you what's the most popular on the platform right and it's these dancing girls right these girls that are dancing dancing and singing and lip syncing and all these different things so when I first went on there I was like well, well that's that's not business-like stuff so I 
but I I kind of still had in the back of my mind Gary V said you should be using TikTok so okay so what does he see in there that I'm not seeing right now so I kind of kept going I went through and then I started searching for people that are using TikTok or I searched for certain keywords like business and marketing and that kind of stuff and then I started seeing uh because I started liking videos about marketers and about you know a, a business building and about uh, about online and social media and tips and tricks and I started liking and commenting on those videos so that's so then I started seeing mostly those in my news feed I still see dancing girls and whatever but that's just because the platform is a lot of that right so but I see more and now I'm starting to now I'm I'm seeing uh, these people that post videos every day on on um, tips on growing your audience on tips on building a business on doing e-commerce sites on building websites on marketing on sales on ads I see all that all the time now in my TikTok and that's because the platform adapted to what I was engaging with what I was liking so that allowed me to learn how to use the platform and I was able to put together this course for you so that you can learn how to use TikTok for your business and you don't have to do silly dancing videos you can certainly do them if you want but you don't have to do those videos that's not like you'll you're not going to see those videos after you post a little while and you start to grow your TikTok <coughs> audience based on your interests and your you know your passion and what you're posting about so that's that's a story that has to do with this how to use TikTok for business without doing silly dancing videos right so it allows me to create a story around that so that then I can have a message I create a, I can create a capture page that has to do with that right so I can go to um well I could create a, a, a I, and I probably should do that I probably should create a um maybe I'll do that in tomorrow's episode where I'm going to actually go in click funnels and actually create a funnel page to promote this particular course I actually haven't done that yet because you know because I've been working on other things but this might be a great opportunity for me to to show you how uh to create a funnel using click funnels and yeah so let's do that tomorrow so that's basically how you how you come up with your one thing you got to think about what it is your offer is then come up with your one thing that you want you're going to use in the rest of your marketing and so we're going to do that tomorrow in the next episode we're going to actually create a funnel using a, a tool called click funnels so if I go let me just show you here click funnels whoops that's clicky course <coughs> click funnels <coughs> so click funnels now of course if you want to get your own click funnel account you got to go you really should be going to cf.jeanserge.gagnon.com or jsgagnon.com <coughs> to that link there actually do I have it on here um I don't think I have it on here PLR. I got a whole bunch of stuff right I mean I got I got a PLR I got uh, my blog I got a chat bot I got a 12-step success got my lead system pro I've got my TikTok course here my Aweber my pin Chris pin credible results my another Aweber I got two Awebers let's rename this one I don't need two Awebers oh let's rename this one let's change this one to CF so that's click funnels uh where is it did I edit this one? Oh, I think I edited what did I do here oh yeah <coughs> P I edited the wrong one hey wherever this one here that's the one I want to edit so there's cf for click funnels <coughs> there you go so that's where you want to go cf jeansergegagnon.com to go check out and get a free um a free where is a rename over here rename so click funnels there you go okay so that's cf okay so you go there to get your click funnels account and you get a free trial so actually let me show you what that looks like so cf cf 
that jean serge that'll take you to this page where you can become a click funnel um you can just do a 14 day free trial right you just click on that to get your trial started out and then that becomes your um click funnel so I can go like this uh, the only thing I think this click funnels does require you to put in a credit card so I can't actually do I suppose I could try to do one here so j so test jsg gs test at fix no why no it is fxos start building my first funnel I wonder if that'll automatically uh if it'll ask me for a credit card or not I haven't done this select plan zero 14 day oh, I see okay I guess I have to do this and then he want yeah he wants all that so let's just if I cancel that I don't know if it'll still let me create a but anyways that's basically click funnels you gotta at least put in your credit card to get even though it's a 14-day free trial uh, but yeah you just go there go to cf.johnsergegagnon.com and just fill that in okay so let's just turn that off anyway so we're going to do that tomorrow we're going to create a funnel we're going to show you how to do that and I'm going to use it for my TikTok course and that'll help me to uh to create uh you know my one thing so you can do your one thing too while we're doing it together all right hopefully you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time